This is David Lemon for Wise Brother Media and Pop Goes the Culture. And today I am talking to someone who may be the youngest person we've ever interviewed on the show. And <laughs> she is a sensation in just like no time at all. Like if, if you were asleep during the summer, you missed it. But 12-year-old <laughs> Tegan Marie uh, made a sensation for herself by covering the uh, hit Holy and got, was it 15 million Facebook views so far, Tegan? Yeah, I think it even bumped up a little bit more. And I just have to say, I'm so thankful for everyone that watched it and has been supporting me. So what happened? So, the, so you put it up just thinking, okay, I'm going to put up my video and, you know, maybe a few of my friends will watch it. Is that what you were thinking or what? Well, I always post a Friday cover video. Um, I try to. And I, like, all my videos that I cover, I, it's just some of the songs that I love to do. And, yeah, Holy was just one of my favorite country summer songs ever. And I just decided to do my own female version of it, not knowing that 15 million views was on its way. So, <laughs> so what happened? But you I'm started, just so you, happy that the... You started racking up the views? Were you, like, freaking out? You're looking at the, you're looking at the, at, at Facebook yeah. and going, what? <laughs> Yeah, like, actually, um, we had 500,000 views within a half hour, Holy and cow. by that time, me and my manager that is from Sweetie High, um, which is an all-girls media website, uh -huh. had five missed FaceTime calls, <laughs> oh, but God. I'm just so happy, yeah, I'm just so happy that the boys themselves and everyone else liked it. Tegan, that is crazy. Okay, so the next thing you know, <laughs> what happened? You started getting phone calls? Yeah, I've, I've had a lot of fan accounts. Like, I have one named Star Tegan that's mm -hmm. amazing, and she's already sent me fan mail. And I'm just really happy, and I'm so thankful that for everyone that has been supporting me throughout my beginning of my journey. And, yeah, I've just... I've just been opening up shows for Hunter Hayes, Cassidy Pope, wow. and actually just sang with Kelsey Ballerini at the Bluebird Cafe down in Nashville. Wow! And you did, you did, you've done the VMAs. You've done, you've done VMA, GMA. Any other MAs coming up? <laughs> CMA. <laughs> I mean, hopefully. <laughs> CMA. I don't know any other MAs. Those are the only ones I know. That's pretty. That's that's pretty awesome. And now you're sing your first single is out, Lucky Me. Tell me about that. Yes. Um, Lucky Me is just all about me being so lucky. as getting to do what I love every day, which is singing. And Lucky Me is very special to me, not only because it is my first single, but because I get to give back to my hometown, Flint, Michigan, which I love dearly. And that's why all proceeds go straight to the Hurley Children's Hospital in my hometown, Flint, Michigan, yeah. for all the children that have been affected by the water crisis. The water crisis is uh, is something that that everybody has been reading about, and it's great that you're able to to sort of give yeah. back on, give back on that level. It's 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 amazing. Yeah, the Flint water crisis. It's 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 a need. Everyone needs it, and you can't. I can't just think about people getting sick. From a basic need without knowing what's going to happen to them within a year or even five years from now. Yeah. So let's talk about uh, singing and songwriting. When did you start songwriting? Actually, I've recently been down in Nashville writing a whole bunch. Um, I just, yeah, I've recently been in Nashville for my first writing session, and I just have to say it is one of my favorite things to do because you're just sitting there and all of a sudden you just come up with something, and it's just magical. Yeah. But I have four songs that I have written so far, and we made like a bet we're only writing in Nashville because it's the core of country music. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, um, I have some songs coming out hopefully really soon, and all I know is that you're going to love it. I can't wait. What do your parents say about all this? They are so supportive they they've been with me throughout my journey like i started singing when i was three years old my dad bought a karaoke machine <laughs> um it was actually his it was actually his but it was my favorite toy i kind of like stole it from him yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah I um, can see that. my dad yeah my dad always 
recorded me, and he's the one that uploaded videos and got me started, too, just like Sweetie High. That is completely incredible. And your friends at school, what do they say? Are you still, do you still go to school with your friends? How's, has that changed? Actually, today was my second day to school, but I haven't been there yet, but I'm <laughs> going to. <laughs> um, but I actually start online school tomorrow. Uh-huh. So I still get to see my friends because I still get to go to my school and the library and just do it all online. They must and be- my friends, they're really supportive. They, yeah, they always share everything. And they're just really happy for me. That's terrific. So how many how many followers do you have on Twitter now? Any idea? Oh, gosh. <laughs> I honestly don't know. <laughs> um, <laughs> it actually, Twitter is amazing. I can check, but. Yeah, you don't have to and check And actually, right I now, just got my. You're good. <laughs> and actually, I got some news. I just got my musically crowned. Which I'm so happy about that and excited. Wow. Wow. So you're, you're doing great. So tell us where we can find Thank your you. song and, your, and where we can keep up with you. What do we look for? Well, you can follow me on, yeah, you can follow me on all my socials, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Musical.ly, Snapchat, under Tegan Marie Official. And I have my own website, TeganMarie.com. And you can find Lucky Me on iTunes. Well, I think I'm going to be looking for it. I was listening to it earlier before we got on the <laughs> phone, and I was just like, ah, this is, this is awesome. I can't believe your voice. Thank you. Uh, who have, Thanks. Who have you heard from? Who of the people that you've, you know, that you've admired? Have you heard from anybody that said, okay, keep going or gotten any good advice? Yes, Kelsey Ballerini. She is the sweetest. Uh, a lot of people actually like Chris Lane, Kelsey herself, Florida Georgia Line shared the video of Holy and said I made them misty eyed, which oh. I'm so thankful for that and that they liked it. And I actually opened for Maddie and Tay and Cam, and they've just all given me really good advice, like keep being yourself and do what you love. And I'm, I'm just following their advice because they're amazing. So far, so good. Tegan, you're doing great. I am I am uh, really Thank happy you. for your success. And I know we're going to be hearing about so much more about you in the years to come. So you got a long career ahead of you. <laughs> Thank you. Plus, you're very well spoken on the telephone. I, I, I admire your maturity <laughs> and your creativity. <laughs> Thank you. Tegan, on behalf of Pop Goes the Culture and Wise Brother Media, thanks for talking to me today. Thank you for having me.